What is an internet cult? In many ways the biggest problem with trying to define what is, or what is not, an internet cult. What definition can you use? In many ways you have to create a definition, but make it so it does not differ too much from the conventional definition of what is a dangerous or potentially dangerous cult, as to make it still valid. Thus, in many ways, we have to stick to the three traits of a potentially dangerous cult, which were originally thought out by Robert J. Lifton. The idea of a charismatic and dominating leader. The idea of thought reform techniques, manipulation, coercion. And, of course, the exploitation, economical, physical, and even sexual. So these three separate traits are still going to be key pivotal points when coming down to the opinion that a group is or is not a dangerous or potentially dangerous cult organisation. I never thought of it that way. Well then what are you talking about? So in a broad sense, an internet cult is an organisation with a charismatic leadership, with a belief that's passed on by persuasion, coercion and thought reform. So if they've truly become indoctrinated, exploitation can easily take place. So in effect, when we say a dangerous cult, we're talking about a dangerous culture or practice, which is open for exploitation, and those who are exploited are so easily affected because they've been manipulated into a point of view, which allows them to be abused. On this point, we don't need to consider what they believe. We don't really need to consider if they believe in aliens, gods, flying monkeys, or trolls at the bottom of the garden. It wouldn't make any difference. What matters is, in regard to categorising cults, not the ridiculous ideas they hold dear, but the practices, and indeed the dangerous and potentially destructive practices, of said organization. If it's not glaringly apparent, then I must have failed to do my job somewhere along the line here.